Yes, Gary's book, The Analogy of Love. Shameless self-promotion. It's coming soon to movie theaters near you. Oh, yeah, that's good. Got to star Tom Cruise, Pamela Hayek, Pamela Anderson, Anderson, Selma Hayek. Thank you from the sewing class. Yeah, the the School of Business, uh, so on a less uh, uh, comic note, uh, the School of Business is involved in a lot of uh, programs uh, internationally designed to, uh, we hope, uh, make the world a better place, and we're partners with some folks in Ethiopia. Uh, and uh, uh, this uh, display case is uh, the site of the science. I think natural beauty is a big deal in Adventism, right? That's absolutely yes. right. Um, take this... Uh, this plant, this is one plant along the, the window here, this giant, uh, it's an African creeping violet, I think is the, the name of it. And, uh, this is one of the permitted pleasures. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> there aren't a lot of permitted pleasures for religious people, but natural beauty is one. It's like it's definitely got that pre-Sabbath feel. Yeah, by the way, your comment about competition, yeah. all of this is evidence of, uh, of pretty aggressive competition oh, on the part wow. of uh, a uh, team of, uh, a successive teams of folks from the School of Business competing in a national and now international business competition, uh, which loss of year, I think, has really helped to transform and focus increasingly on using business skills to make the world a better place. So I'm really pleased by our impact on that. It's nice and clean. They keep yeah. the campus nice. Oh, yeah, the campus is actually uh, a uh, state registered arboretum. There's so many varieties of interesting plants. Wow, this is nice. That's the library. Uh, it's so nice. Feels like PUC. Yeah, okay. it is very peaceful. So it feels like Pacific Union College and mm. Avondale College. It's got that peaceful beautiful, natural beauty, understated, clean, yeah, Protestant feel. Uh, this is, uh, in some sense, the, the heart of the campus. Whole Memorial Auditorium, probably the, the most attractive building on campus and the one that figures in a lot of uh, campus uh, uh, promotional materials. Uh, it's home to, most importantly, the music program. Uh, as uh, we said before, music is one of those things that uh, it's, the, it's the one fine art that Adventism has uh, uh, honored people for right. performing in. And, uh, A little so more than movie making. Yes, for instance. <laughs> so, uh, uh, Not a lot of Seventh-day Adventist playwrights. No, though, you know, interesting, one of my uh, contemporaries from here uh, is a writer in Hollywood, was actually one of the uh, staff writers on Married with Children. Really? Uh, yeah. What's his name? Uh, her name is Helen Pye. Helen Pye. P-I? P-A-I. P-A-I. Um, so wow, I didn't know the Seventh-day Adventist writers on TV shows. So mu mu music has been the, uh, mm -hmm. really, I think, one of the most impressive. So beautiful. Uh, which houses the College of Arts and Sciences and the School of Religion of News Offices. Well, that door isn't open. Which you can side there somehow. But, uh, Knock and it shall be opened unto you. Well, doesn't, doesn't the good book say that? It does say that. Uh, but you have to knock loud enough. I'm going to try other doors. So this is, yeah, this is the thing. The campus gets shut down so early on Friday right. afternoon. But, uh, um, I, I don't know if you remember, uh, if you know the name Fritz Guy. Yes, very familiar. You know, Fritz uh, used to quit that when he was Dean of Arts and Sciences here. Not everyone here keeps the Sabbath, but everyone keeps Friday afternoon. And, uh, that's a good that's, line. I think that's right. I'm going to get this door opened. So I grew up on Seventh-day Adventist College campuses uh, for my first 14 years, basically. Well, 
from age uh, age six to fourteen. I from six age six to age eleven Avondale College, and then from age eleven to fourteen Pacific Union College in the Napa Valley. And then I would return during the summers to Pacific Union College during high school, and also on some weekends. Uh, it's good.